In this session, I'm going to show you the steps of how to integrate WhatsApp with Zo CRM natively. So usually with those sessions, I will show you on my screen exactly how it's going to work. In this case, I'm not going to do it. And the main reason is that it's very difficult to get a WhatsApp commercial number to work with uh, any system. Facebook is making it very, very difficult to buy a number from them, a WhatsApp number, and therefore this is why it's so complicated to produce this demo. I will show you the steps of how to get a number from Facebook. I will show you the steps of how to integrate it with Zoho CRM and everything is on the way. Now, just heads up, Zoho are coming up with a new module named Messages. It's something new. It will be in the marketplace, I assume, in the next few months. But just understand that the messages module will have SMS, WhatsApp, uh, the different social messaging, for example, uh, Facebook messages, Twitter messages, emails, and open cases. So you will have one section a messages with lots of cool stuff. During this session, I will show you different pages with different documentation. Those links will be in the description below. Feel free to browse and click around and you will be able to follow the steps the same as I will show you in this session. We are going to start our journey with uh, the WhatsApp business integration. So first of all, you will see here that you will need to have a Facebook account. And of course, it needs to be a business account. Then you will need to uh, buy a WhatsApp number and the WhatsApp number will need to be purchased directly from Facebook. Now, the way that the messaging system is going to work on Zoho CRM, there will be a direct integration with Twilio. So you will not need any module in between to accommodate the SMS, WhatsApp, and so on. Whenever you finishing with all that, you will need to set up an account on Zoho CRM, and then you will need to do the integration. You can see that you will have here under channels. And if I will go to channels, you will see here that you will have here a, a new module named business messaging. Okay, right now I do not have it on my side and I checked also all my 50 systems. I didn't see in any of them. But anyway, when it will be released, you will have it here under the channels and that will be business messaging. And from here, it will be relatively simple to integrate. The biggest pain point will be this guy. It's to retrieve a number from Facebook. Okay, that's what will cause, will cause more problems and will take more time. But will, whenever you will have it, you will be able to integrate it with uh, Twilio and integrate it with uh, Zoho CRM. The next step, it's, uh, and I will also provide you a link to all those three pages, of course. Uh, the business messaging uh, will explain how the business messaging module is going to work like. Uh, I don't know if you can see here, but you will have a messages uh, a tab and the messages tab will show you the messages that will include, as I said before, the Twilio messages, the uh, WhatsApp, SMS, uh, Facebook, open cases, Twitter, and also email messages. So everything will be in one place, which is awesome. I think Zo nailed it. Uh, with this functionality. Uh, you can see here also, for example, that you have uh, in the messages module, you can see the different messages, messages that came in. You can see also the communication. So it will work basically like a related module and you will have there all the communication that you had with the person and it doesn't matter if it's email, messages and so on. Extremely convenient. Okay, so I'm going to uh, provide you those three links so you can enjoy and, and browse them. Um, every year or so, there is this big feature. I think this is the feature for 2021. So if we'll have it by the end of the year active, I think it's a huge win. Retail businesses 
are really trying to get a hold of WhatsApp integration natively in Zo CRM, SMS, and also I, I know lots of commercial businesses, B2B, that are serving clients across countries. They also desperately need this WhatsApp integration because it's not every country will have access to quality SMS services or, or even phone systems. So uh, WhatsApp will solve a huge problem for the business, especially when multiple agents are talking to different clients and usually they're using their own phones. So the business is losing control on the communication. Big, big thing. So guys, as always, thumbs up if you like this feature. Zo needs to know what you think about them. And I think Zo are doing fantastic work with listening to what you have to say and apply it on their system. Thank you very much, guys. We'll see you in the next session.